My friends, would you look at this yumminess? Here's what we got cooking for you today. We're making a return. We were here once before, wintertime, November that is, freezing cold. It was brutal. But put one of the biggest browns I've ever caught in my life, actually the biggest brown I've ever caught in my life, in the net down in this stretch of water we're going to. Right now we're going down through Tick Alley. I say that because it's green, there's been a lot of moisture, and them little bastards like moisture and they like green grass. They like to jump on us humans. Give us tick bites, it costs nasty, nasty, nasty sickness. So anyhow, as for me, my friends, I'm excited to be on the water here momentarily. I've needed some fly fishing therapy. Spend some time with you all, make a video. It's been a while, so I'm excited to be here have the opportunity to do this again. So we're gonna check out the tailwater of the Yampa. Uh, everything is finally coming down from this incredible um, winter that we had in Colorado. Just unbelievable the amount of snowfall that came down. So what we're gonna do, everything's kind of ripping and gripping out there still. So we're gonna hang out here on the tailwater of the Yampa, just outside a steamboat. Uh, we're gonna pick the river apart um, kind of give you insight what I'm doing. I have been fishing. I haven't been, uh, I just haven't been filming. So just take some downtime. Uh, been through a roller coaster with the health up and down and uh, finally got everything lined out with the doctors. We're back up on the straight and narrow. Now we just got to get our fly fishing therapy on. So been super busy. Uh, like I said, I've definitely have been fishing. Uh, been out on the lakes, been kokanee fishing, uh, spending lots of time with the family, having a lot of fun, really enjoying the spring. Uh, and the summer. I uh, even put some bass in the net, put a walleye in the net. That thing was awesome. So that's been really fun to mix it up. Um, let the waters calm down, let the snow come off the mountain. It's just been incredible to see all the lakes and everything is full and just busting at the seams. So with that, my friends, it is time for another Beyond the Fly episode from the Yampa. Let's get down on the water, my friends.
uh, having a really good time. Got a uh, Kaufman Stone on, uh, followed by another, uh, oh, I got like a Caddis Emerger, and then uh, rocking it with the uh, Betas. Bam, getting it done. We we're putting fish on, some healthy fish, beautiful, strong. Uh, yeah, this river is rocking and rolling. They definitely are loving the uh, post winter, all the food coming down the conveyor belt. Hope you guys are enjoying this episode. Let's try to catch a couple more before we gotta spool up and hit the road. That's a big bull. Howdy, friend. All right, stop it, crocodile. Uh, winning setup today ended up being the uh, use a Kaufman stone fly for my weight to get it down and then uh, had a caddis emerger and then ended up with a uh, betis imitation in a red and that got it done lit it up I have no more flies I done lost them all so I gotta remember to uh, retie my stuff on after a couple fish get hooked up so those bigger ones they got the little teeth in there they're saw away at your uh, five and six x tibet there so i need to do that but overall really happy with the time on the water uh it took a little bit to kind of just get adjusted it took about an hour uh just to get my bearings straight with where i needed to get the uh distance uh, between my cider and also the weight of the fly and once we got that dialed in it was game on from there my friends so it worked out really really well they weren't super deep about midwater column and uh, yeah I got my eyes adjusted to looking for those shapes and shadows in the water and uh, yeah worked out really really good my friends but yeah super grateful uh, just can't say enough about the day I do want to say thanks to each and every one of you for uh, hanging in there with me uh, especially during this time of absence as I uh, do some more healing and recovery and take care of myself so thank you for uh, yeah not giving up on me I goes, hope you guys enjoy this episode and the time and uh, appreciate you uh, standing beside me there and the uh, Beyond the Fly YouTube channel. So I'll be happy to get this one posted. And uh, yeah, got any uh, questions, comments, leave them below. Uh, hit that like button, smash that thing, set the hook on it. I greatly appreciate it. If you haven't subscribed, please do so. Look forward to having you here at the uh, Beyond the Fly family. And that's it, my friends, that's all we got. Short and sweet and to the point. The uh, Euro Nymphing Rig, Moonshine, Midnight Special, banging it out. More and more in the basket, bigger and bigger, healthier and healthier, fun, 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 all on Beyond the Fly. Hope you enjoyed this edition of uh, the Fly Fishing Therapy, and uh, we'll catch you all next time. Tight lines.